welcome to the AACS Daily News. The United Regional Chamber of Commerce has selected State Representative Betty Poirier as their 2018 Person of the Year. Chamber President Jack Lank said that she was chosen for her support for businesses in the community and we spoke with him to learn more. We're here at Plain Ridge Park Casino uh, today to celebrate our 101st annual meeting for the United Regional Chamber of Commerce. We have a full house today. Um, we're honoring our Person of the Year, which is State Rep Betty Poirier and our Business of the Year, which is Bristol County Savings Bank. To get nominated as Person of the Year, you have to have helped out the different communities that you're involved in, uh, help with some of the nonprofits, some of the charities, uh, and just be a champion uh, for the different communities. Their uh, nominations come from all over. They come from private people. They come from businesses. I'm honored and I'm humbled all at the same time because uh, I never think of myself in that vein. Uh, I just feel privileged to be where I am and be able to serve the people that live in my district. I'm delighted, honestly. I tease everyone and say they ran out of everybody else and that's why they picked me. Bristol County Savings Bank is truly honored to have received this uh, award. Uh, there are a lot of uh, community banks in, in, in the greater region that the uh, United uh, Regional Chamber of Commerce serves. Uh, all doing great things, so we are extremely proud that we were actually singled out today to receive this award. I, I really believe it's really due to our commitment to the community and the things that we get involved with. We're a bank, all banks do the same things for their customers, but it's really the commitment to community that I think sets us apart and one of the reasons why uh, the Chamber honored us today with this tremendous award. As far as our business of the year, um, you must be a chamber member and then chamber members are nominated by other chamber members by outside organizations uh, as most of you know bristol county savings bank is the largest savings bank in bristol county and uh, they have given away over two million dollars to the different charities just this past year in 2017 and so they were nominated as our business of the year uh, this year uh, betty was um, nominated by sturdy memorial foundation uh, deb gildea uh, over there. Deb's fabulous. She's been there for years. Uh, and she just felt with all the work that Betty has done that it, it was time that we recognize her. Our keynote speaker this year is Dr. Bruce Auerbach. He's the president and CEO of Sturdy Memorial Hospital. Uh, he's going to come in and he's going to touch a little bit on um, the health care costs, which is just astronomical as most of the small businesses know. But he's also going to talk today about a ballot initiative that's coming up about the nurse patient ratio and how that would affect all of the hospitals in the state of Massachusetts. The relationship that I try to foster with everyone I deal with, whether it's uh, the businesses in my district, the organizations such as the Chamber, uh, or uh, my colleagues in the State House, uh, as well as the constituents and the many organizations, it's all about people. And that is what my belief is, that's what I've tried to foster throughout my career. Not only this career, but whatever I've done in my life is to uh, build relationships with people and try to listen and get, gain knowledge from them and find ways to be helpful and influential for the better good. A community bank, especially a mutual community bank, which Bristol County Savings Bank is, we do not have stockholders. so. Our board of directors uh, culture is, is giving back to the community as the stakeholder as opposed to paying dividends to stockholders. So with that being said, uh, you know, we, we contribute to the community. This past year our charitable foundation gave out uh, nearly two million dollars in, in grants to local nonprofits doing tremendous things to make our communities a better place to live and work. And uh, besides that too, what I'm most proud of is that uh, our employees donated over 6,000 hours this past year to these same types of nonprofits doing great things. That's it for today's update. You can watch all of our content in high definition by visiting our website, AACS.com, by downloading the AACS mobile app or visiting the AACS Roku channel. For AACS News, I'm Austin Ricketts.